Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Halo sahabat Aliper semua dimanapun berada Selamat datang kembali di channel I People Bagaimana kabarnya? Saya Rokan semoga sehat selalu panjang umur dan dilancarkan rezekinya Oke baiklah Di video kali ini kita akan melihat lagi reaksi dari pengamat musik dan reaktor dari luar negeri Yang akan memeriksa salah satu cover kita Ali Bata ya guys dan bagaimanakah keseruan reaksinya tanpa bahasa masih lagi mari kita cek videonya. Here go. Ah, right, let's do it. Oke. So far, um, I really like that intro that uh, I really couldn't pick whether it was kind of a classical or a flamenco inspired thing, but it definitely wasn't like the standard jazzy. That's a seven string and he's kind of playing it like, um, it almost sounds like <laughs> Like a really, really talented bass player. He must be finger picking. I've heard I've heard this uh, pieces of this before for sure. Oh my god! Yeah. The whole that whole part when he, they come back in is like ding 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 and like yep. the whole weird picking thing has always blown my mind. I mean, I've always seen like videos of people <clears throat> doing that and like there was one guy I seen a long time ago was doing like uh, thunderstruck acoustic and he was yeah. doing everything like picking and like yeah. that is so amazing. But, it is. It really is, man. And it, what it does is like instead of just your generic strumming and picking. Um, it gives like other layers and textures to the guitars yeah, and the bass. Yeah, bleeps you know? and bloops that wouldn't even you have thought to have been yeah. there that actually sound cool. Yeah, and it's not like they're the only people to do it, obviously. But like you know, generally you hear that more with bass, where you have like the slap yeah. bass and yeah, the yeah, pops yeah. and you know, yep. and they're doing it with the guitar and the bass is doing it. So yeah, I mean, it's very, just very, a constant progression of yeah. different stuff. Super talented though, freaking super talented. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm really curious how to know to make a sound of a car revving its engine on a guitar. He's all over the neck using all of his fingers. Um, it's and it's still sounds like to me listening to it like a very uncomplicated yeah, melody like too little. but every note is so clean and and as close to perfect as you can get it just sounds beautiful like i like it it's <laughs> um i don't normally listen to a lot of bands that are all instrumental but i could definitely chill and listen to this I feel like he's doing the work of uh, two people. I mean, he's got obviously got another guitar player with yeah. him. And he's doing some things that complement him, um, but I just it's just crazy. That's a lot of busy work <laughs> uh, with his hands. 
um, just that kind of proficiency is it's just crazy to me um but you know dedication a lot of work that'll get you there it can get anybody there i, I don't think guitar is anything that's like hereditary or anything like you just you aren't born good at guitar right um i think there's there are some things like you know the size of your hands length of your fingers i always felt like when i tried to learn how to play guitar like i always felt like i was holding this really um weird like this really uh how do you put it um i always felt like i was trying to control with my hands this really clunky object and i can never find a comfortable way to play and my left hand fingers on the fretboard were very difficult because they're my fingers are kind of short small chunky hands it's hard to not accidentally cover strings you're not trying to and i just never got down like the dexterity to do that you know um and honestly if i worked a little bit harder at it maybe i could have at some point but it was just uh, i don't know it just didn't it never felt natural, and that sucks, you know, because I really wanted to be good at that. Yeah. Um, but maybe I just didn't want it enough. Those riffs underneath sounded sick and the singing was really loud which I mean that that's what should be the loudest part but like I wanted to hear the guitars more maybe that's because I'm a guitarist impresses me so much is that they can remember all this stuff <laughs> um just remembering that and remembering the solos that's something i never ever understood but i mean if you're if you're doing it because you can feel it and you have that melody in your head then obviously it's not a matter of remembering <laughs> takes me away takes me to a different place that I'm used to and I need to do that I need to get outside the box of my that I've kind of put myself in I think I've said that like a billion times I'm a bit redundant 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 um but yeah this is cool I just <laughs> that was fucking crazy they're man. very good dude yeah I mean that's the kind of stuff you go to the show and you just like sit back and just enjoy musicianship you know what I mean yeah it's cool that that picking like that Again, that blows me away, that kind of stuff. Yeah. Like, how much pinpoint talent you need to have to be able to do all that in a, in sequence that sounds good and then and then just... And not fuck it up. And not mess it up and keep layering on and yeah. layering on and keep going and going. That's insane. Okay, guys. Sekian dulu videonya ya. Dan mudah-mudahan video tadi dapat menghibur kita semua. Dan jangan lupa tinggalkan komentarnya di bawah ini. Saya ucapkan terima kasih kepada teman-teman semua yang telah selalu setia menonton video reaksi Ali Bata. Oke, baiklah. Saya ucapkan terima kasih sekali lagi. Dan mudah-mudahan di dalam bulan Ramadan ini, 
segala amal ibadah kita diterima di sisi Allah Subhanahu wa Amin. Amin. Oke, baiklah saya pamit undur diri dulu dan sampai jumpa di video selanjutnya.